Hey everyone, so in this video, we're gonna learn about the standard error of estimate. So a lot of times a linear regression model describes a relationship really well, but sometimes it doesn't describe it that well. And so we wanna be able to measure that. We want some type of statistic that can help us see how well is the model re describing the two variables. Another, another name for the standard error of estimate is it's also called the standard error of the regression, and it measures this un uncertainty. So if we can look at this, we can look at this equation here. And what we're essentially doing is we're taking our actual value minus our predicted value, squaring it, divided by n minus two and finding the square root. What does that look similar to? Standard deviation. So essentially what we're doing is we're just taking the standard deviation, simplifies to this standard deviation of our error term. So if we run back up to our original model, we're taking y minus our predicted variable of y, equals our error term. And we're finding the standard deviation of this error term. That's all we're doing. So let's try to see if we can represent this visually. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna import matplotlib pyplot as plt. I'm gonna import numpy as np. First, we're gonna create a scatter plot, so plt.scatter. And we're gonna take our original data frame and we're going to say rm minus rf that's our excess returns of the market and we're also going to plot our other data frame r minus rf the excess returns of apple so let's plot that first see what that looks like there we go and now what i would like to do is plot the the actual line of best fit here and so to do that please bear with me so x the value equals np dot lin space and remember np lin space outputs a linear output of several values minimum to maximum so we're going to specify our minimum value it's just going to be bf rm minus rf that's our x variable and we're going to just find the minimum value of that and i'm just going to copy this here and we're also going to find the maximum value and we're going to output 50 values there we go. And now what we need to do is we need to add a constant. So we're gonna say SM for our stats models dot add constant X predicted value. And we're just gonna output this to X predicted value two is equal to that like so. And finally, we're gonna say Y predicted value is equal to results. We're gonna take the results, that's our model that we built earlier dot and we're going to use the dot predict function and we're going to input our predicted values here and finally we can plot this plt.plot x predicted value y predicted value and we're going to specify our color equals and we're just going to say green we'll run that see if that works there we go and so again what is standard error of estimate, it's measuring this dispersion around this line of best fit. So for example, if we have an X, if we have an X input here, our line, our model predicts that it should be here. This should be the value that it should predict, but the actual value is here. And so we're, kind of, we're trying to measure this, this dispersion, and that is what standard error of estimates do. So in our next video, we're actually gonna calculate this, and till next time, thank you.